Welcome to the Third Wave Business Systems EFT File Generation Process Review. My name is Dennis Tucker. I'm a technical manager at Third Wave, and I'll be providing you with a demonstration of how to generate the EFT files for incoming and outgoing payments that will be transmitted to your bank. Designating an invoice to be paid by EFT bank transfer is accomplished through the payment method, bank account, and business partner setup processes that have been covered in previous sessions. Both incoming and outgoing EFT transactions are processed through the SAP Business One Payment Wizard. During that process, validation checks will be performed. At the end of the Payment Wizard run, you will have the option of creating the EFT files. Select the Banking menu, Payment Wizard option. Click the Next button on the Payment Wizard screen. For this demonstration, I'll select the option to start a new Payment Wizard run. Click the Next button. Choose the outgoing and or incoming payment types based upon the documents that you wish to process and the options your EFT format supports. If both options are selected, credit and debit records will be combined into one file. Please note, for business partners who do not use bank transfers, you can create checks as part of the same payment run. Payment Wizard runs may contain more than one bank account. The TWBS EFT processing application will create a separate file for each account included in the run. Click the Next button to proceed to Step 3 of the Payment Wizard. Click the Add button and enter the criteria for a range of business partners that you wish to include in the Payment Wizard run. The criteria can be as simple as a range of business partner codes or can also include additional filtering including customer group and vendor group. When you've completed entering your criteria, click the OK button. Select or deselect the desired business partners as needed. When you've completed your selection, click the Next button to move on to the next step of the Payment Wizard. For the AP and AR transaction sections, Specify a desired from and to date for the due date ranges of each section. You may also select other document parameter criteria as needed. When you finish your document parameters, Click the Next button to move on to the next step of the Payment Wizard. Select the designated Bank Transfer Payment Methods and any other payment methods you want to include in this payment run. Click the Next button to move on to the next step of the Payment Wizard. If a business partner is not set up properly for EFT processing or a bank associated with the bank transfer payment method is not set up for EFT, the user will not be able to select the associated invoices. EFT processing will also deselect the checkboxes for the invalid invoices and business partners. Click the TWBS non-included button to see a report of errors, if any, preventing the bank transfer for these partners or invoices. If you wish to verify any of the information on the business partner or document before proceeding, the business partner master data screen is accessible from the arrow next to the business partner code. The invoices are also available through the link to arrow next to the document number. 
You can check the payment method on either an AP invoice or an AR invoice before proceeding to the next step of the payment wizard. Click the next button to continue. Select the Execute option on the Save Options screen and click the Next button to move on to the next step of the payment wizard. The user will be prompted to confirm that they wish to continue executing the payment wizard and generating payment documents. Click Yes to continue. Once the payment wizard has been successfully executed, you will receive a message and you can click the OK button. Click the Next button on the Payment Wizard to continue. Select the Outgoing Payments and Incoming Payments checkboxes and click the Generate EFT Files button. The TWBS Process EFT file form will display a list of each account for which a bank transfer file has been created, indicating the name and location for each file. Transmit the bank transfer files to your banking institution. If you do not want to send them immediately, note the names and locations of the files generated so they can be sent at a later time. Your bank will not know of the bank transfers until they have received the files and processed them. Click the OK button to return to the document and report printing screen of the payment wizard. If you would like to generate printed or emailed remittances to send to your business partners, click the Generate EFT Remittance button. You can also print any other reports that you would like from this screen before finishing. Click the Finish button to close the Payment Wizard screen. This concludes our demonstration of the EFT file generation process. For more information on Third Wave's electronic funds transferring application or any of the other applications that Third Wave offers, please visit our website at www.twbs.com. You can click the Contact Us link in the upper right corner of the page. Existing Third Wave partners and customers can obtain more information through the support portal by clicking the Customer Support link in the upper right corner of the page. Thank you for your time and attention.